Hey everybody, it's uh, just days away from the Geis Lake Coalition's Blast on the Bridge. It's going to be on July 4th, which is next Wednesday, and the bridge shuts down about 5.30 to traffic and about 6 it reopens for all the pedestrians and all the people to come onto the bridge. It, that bridge is almost a mile long. It's eight tenths of a mile long, so lots of room there for vendors. We've got, uh, I think, about 15 or so food vendors coming out. They're selling uh, alcohol on the bridge, so you can't bring your own alcohol on the bridge, but you can buy it once you're there. Um, last year, there's some frustration with tickets. People had to buy tickets to buy alcohol. This year, we're just gonna ID people as you come in, and then you can just pay cash for your alcohol like any, anywhere else. Um, we also got soft drinks, um, all kinds of activities for the kids, a big kid zone this year. We've had it last year, but this year it's a little bit bigger, so we have some more inflatable things and some other things for the kids to do, face painting, balloon animals, all those kinds of things. And then we're going to shoot off the fireworks around 10.15 or so. Um, I would be in my spot before 10, kind of stake out your claim, but uh, around 10 o'clock, 10.15 or so, we're going to actually shoot the fireworks off. Um, again, no coolers on the bridge, so you can't bring coolers and you can't bring alcohol, but you can bring blankets and you can bring lawn chairs. You can bring other things, strollers and things for your kids. Um, I would suggest getting out there early as I go over the railroad tracks. And I also suggest um, making sure you get there early and stay hydrated and um, and just take, take in the night. Now the thing I want to do a call out for today is our boat parade. Um, the boat parade is something that's an annual tradition. Uh, last year we had about 40 boats in the parade and it is a wonderful time. If you live at Geist and you've got a pontoon or you've got a ski boat, decorate it up. This year's theme is your um, show your team spirit. So you can decorate it in however you want as far as your favorite team. Pacers, Colts, maybe it's a college team. Uh, our Grand Marshals this year are from, uh, we've got cheerleaders from uh, Lawrence Central, Lawrence North, Hamilton Southeastern, and Fishers High School. They're going to be our Grand Marshals for the parade. There's no cost to enter it. And pack a pickup is on Monday at Eddie's. So if you're interested in that, go to our website, which just got relaunched today, geislake.org or geislake.com. They both resolve the same spot. And just click on the Boat Parade link, and it'll tell you all about it, who you need to contact. And uh, Kim Irich would love to get you slotted and in there. This year we got something we've never had before. we got some cash prizes. So the best boat gets a $500 cash from the uh, Geist Marina Limited. So they're sponsoring 500 bucks cash to whoever wins the Boat Parade. Um, second prize is a um, $100 gift card. Uh, it's a gas card, actually, from Geist Marina Limited. And then third prize is $100 from the N3 Boat Works. You gotta go to their showroom and pick out anything you want. You know, tubes, uh, cords for your boat, uh, towels, whatever it might be. So I gotta take that call. But anyway, have a good day. I'll be in touch with some more information and uh, stay cool today.